थ्योरी एंड प्रैक्टिस ऑफ सिल्विकल्चर लेक्चर नंबर 11 इन दिस सिल्विकल्चर सिस्टम विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द क्लियर फैलिंग सिस्टम दैट इज द क्लियर स्ट्रिप सिस्टम एंड द अल्टरनेट स्ट्रिप सिस्टम इन द प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैव गॉन थ्रू द क्लियर फैलिंग सिस्टम एंड द क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ सिल्विकल्चर सिस्टम सो क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ द सिल्वी सिस्टम ऑलरेडी वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द हाई फॉरेस्ट एंड द कॉपीज फॉरेस्ट इन द हाई फॉरेस्ट सिस्टम वी हैव द सिस्टम ऑफ कंसेंट्रेटेड रिजनरेशन we have the system of diffuse regeneration we have the accessory system in the system of a concentrated regeneration uh, already i have uh, discussed about the age gradation and we have discussed about the age class so age gradation where same age cupes uh, may have first year age second year age third year age fourth year age age class is like this 0 to 1 2 2 3 4 to 5 like this age class or 0 to 5 6 to 10 11 to 15 like age age class as we make but in system of diffuse regeneration we don't have age class it is a mixed one then we have accessory system so let's come back to system of concentrated regeneration we have two system under this system of concentrated regeneration one is called clear selling filling system other one is called shelter wood system in clear filling system the clear filling system we have discussed in the previous lecture now in this lecture we'll be discussing about the clear strip system and the alternate strip system in the coming lectures we'll be discussing about the uniform system the group system the shelter wood strip system wagner's band of samslung ever heard wedge system strip and the group system irregular shelter wood system indian irregular shelter wood system and in the system of diffuse regeneration we'll discuss the two system called selection system and the group selection system and in the accessory system we'll discuss the two storied high forest system high forest reserve and improvement filing now so as in the clear filling system it was said that in one operation we'll cut down the entire coupe but sometime it is not possible to clear fell the whole compartment in one operation so we do in strips uh, we do in strips we, we cut down in we make the entire uh, compartment into strips and then we fell down annually like this we, a strip system we do it if it is not possible to cut down or fell down the whole in one operation so this clear strip system and the alternate strip system we do it why the objective is regenerate the area naturally by seed from adjoining area so we depend some of the seed to be germinated from adjoining area now number 2 is the protection of young crop against wind snow and insulation there are the two objective for clear strip and the alternate strip system let's do the first clear strip system the clear strip system is defined as a silviculture system in which the clear felling is done in form of strips and the progress successively in one direction it will gain go in one direction usually against the prevailing wind so if wind is coming from here we'll do felling from here so how we will do as the strip fellings are made progressively in one direction it is also known as progressive clear felling strip system so this is the wind coming from here we have made the strips here these strips will be divided into cutting sections okay one cutting section two cutting section three cutting section and the fourth cutting section and we'll start felling to against the wind felling will be against the wind direction now it is usually necessary to divide the regeneration area into as many as cutting sections so for example what is cutting section cutting section is a subdivision of felling series formed with the objective of regulating felling this is one cutting section see and we have made strips under the cutting section there is another cutting section so we have divided into for example i am just giving an example four cutting sections we have divided into four cutting sections and this is against the wind how we will fell it suppose felling can be done in years the regeneration area will have to be divided into four cutting sections i will mark in roman 1 2 3 4 okay we will mark in 1 2 3 and 4 will mark it and how we will fell it so we will fell against the wind so wind is coming from here you can see the wind wind is coming from here okay felling will do against the wind 
so this is the felling we have done here okay so where natural regeneration by seed from unfilled area our objective is the natural regeneration from unfilled area so natural regeneration will come from unfilled area may progress against the direction of the prevailing wind will will, will progress against the direction of the prevailing wind so that the seed from the unfilled area will disseminate in the clear strip area okay so let's me give you this strip again we have divided into four four cutting sections right this four cutting sections and we have made strip here here we'll cut down first we'll cut down here first year we'll cut down here okay here 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 strip here strip like this so we marked this strip 1 2 3 4 we will come again back 5 6 7 8 we will come back again here in the cutting section 1 9 then we will go into 2 10 then 11 then 12 we will go back here 13 then 14 we will cut here 15 will cut here 16 will cut simultaneously we are cutting down so we will cut down in this, in the pattern will against the wind so first we will cut down here second here third here and fourth here similarly we will go for fifth here sixth here seventh here eighth here like this we'll keep on going so in the last we'll be coming here like 17th 18th 19 and then 20 will be cutting here now one thing we have to take care when we cut down the last here here we will get the seed from adjoining area here we can get from adjoining here which is already grown up uh, uh, which we have cut down in the first here in the last we are dependent how we are we have to keep the one strip in the last at least we will not harvest this this is a source of seed for the last strip when clear felling in the last strip in a cutting section a belt of trees should be left on the windward side to serve as a seed bearer for the last strip and clear fell later when the area get regenerated when this area will get regenerated then only will fell this last strip so this care we have to keep okay so this system is the oldest system which uh, one example is pinus casea in assam uh, for as a, just as an example with a clear strip system next is the alternate strip system it is similar to the clear strip system but it is alternate the objective is same uh, objective is again uh, regenerate the area naturally by seed from adjoining area and to protect the young crop against wind uh, snow and insulation how we do it let's understand the alternate strip system may be defined as a silviculture system in which the clear felling is done in form of strips and the clear felled strips alternate with unfelled strip of similar width or maybe different width uh, may be narrow or wider so this is uh, unfelled and this is felled so this is alternate one one strip is felled one is unfelled one is felled one is unfelled one is felled one is unfelled this is alternate strip system so how to do it the width the very important is what should be the width of uh, unfelled and felled the width of felled and unfelled varies from place to place uh, troop has suggested width of clear felled strip to be 36 meter to 54 meter alternating with unfelled of similar width he says that it should be 36 to 50 meter here and same 36 to 50 meter of unfelled Normandy in France clear fell strips 40 to 50 meter in Normandy it is 40 to 50 clear fell and unfilled is how much 15 to 20 meter in America width of the felled strip is recommended to be about the double of unfilled so if it is 20 meter here so what will be the unfilled it will be the 40 meter here and double that one and in india there are two two uh, two widths which has been suggested one is clear fell strips was 12 meter and 20 meter while the width of unfilled is 36 and 80 
So, if it is 12 meter, it is 36 meter, if it is 20 meters, it is respectively. But in recent trial now, it has been changed now here. It is says that now it is either 15 chains or 300 meter. It says it is similar. In India, it is if it is 300 meter here of field, similar unfilled is of 300 meter. So, 300 meter is filled, 300 meter is unfilled in India now. And one example is Acacia Minsai in Tamil Nadu, which is been taken as a example for alternate clear filling system. So, alternate strip system, the mode of regeneration, the initially felled strips are regenerated naturally. So, first if these strips are there, the seed stored in that area, here is the example of a seed stored in the area. Already seed is been stored as acacia mensia here, when 300 meter wide is been felled here, the regeneration is coming up naturally by the seed stored in that area here. And uh, this will be regenerated how? Next. The clear felled strip, strip system get regenerated by the seed already lying dormant, seed stored in that area and the young crops from the lateral protection of the unfilled strips. The alternate strip are clear felled after 5 years or mid rotation. Now for example, if I want to go back, this, this area was regenerated by seed stored in the area. But how this area from where the regeneration comes, it says either it will come from the seed of nearby area when it is mid rotation of acacia means I of 5 years old. When it is 5 year old mid rotation, it is ready to give the seeds. So, it is able to produce the seed in mid rotation. So, all the trees in the mid rotation, rotation definitely they will uh, produce the seeds. So, uh, the seeds we get from two sides in alternate strip system. Either in the first time we go, seeds will be from two sides. Either seeds will be from this nearby strips or from seeds stored in the area. So, it definitely the germination will come, regeneration will come. And in that, uh, in that strip, we also depend on the seed stored in the area and alternate or nearby where it was felt earlier which has been regenerated when it is 5 year old or mid rotation it will regenerate. So, this way alternate strip system we can get it. Now, consideration for the application is very important. Why this clear filling system is been considered? What are the considerations? What care we should go for regeneration when we go for clear filling system? Considering the application of this clear felling system, because this clear felling system is more artificial system as it involves more money, more labor. So, we have to go for careful consideration while applying the clear felling system. The first is the factor of locality, then is the potential productivity of the site, and third one is species and composition of the crop. As first is the factor of locality because microclimate plays a very important role for the selection of the specific species, the temperature, the rainfall which is suited to that area. So, that consideration has to be taken care even the biotic interference because biotic also influence more to the clear felling system because we need for the protection of that side. The next is potential productivity. When we go for the potential productivity of the site, if the site has a poor potential productivity, we have to go for soil amendment, fertilizer and irrigation for the first two year to give the better results. And the third one is species and composition of the crop. As this system prefers more suited to the light demand of species, so we can replace the slow growing species with the light demand of species so that the clear felling system is best suited to the site considering these three factors as factor of locality, as potential productivity of the site and species and composition of the crop. Let us discuss about the advantages of clear felling system. So, it is the simplest of all high forest system. It does not require any high degree of skill. As felling is concentrated, the felling and logging is very feasible. The felling is concentrated. 
and the yield per unit is also more and consequently the cost of filing and extraction is low introduction of fast growing exotic and we can introduce the fast growing exotics and regulate the composition of new crops increasing the valuable species there is no damage to new crop by felling as this system does not involve in damage of new crops by felling of the mature trees because this system the felling is done in one operation as compared to the shelter wood system it makes supervision easy in this system supervision is very easy and the success and the failure of the regeneration is absolutely very clear by the end of second year disadvantage it is most artificial system the soil remain open there is more danger of soil deterioration and soil erosion in this system after the harvesting as the soil remains exposed till the canopy closure happens so there is a danger of soil deterioration due to erosion the danger of weed and grass invasion as clear felling makes the absence of forest cover in early stages so there is a danger of invasion of weeds grasses and even fire hazards then it produces even age crop which is less resistant to damage by wind as it produces an even age crop so this system is less resistant to the damage by wind and snow and due to its pure in nature it is more susceptible to insect pest or even pathogen and the last is when the crop is pure it becomes more susceptible to damage of insect plant pest and pathogens so thank you very much this is the clear felling system which has been covered in my coming lectures will be going for the silviculture system that is shelterwood system keep watching thank you very much